Hi, it's Corrine for the Cut at Home Design Team and today I'm making a thank you card from start to finish and I wanted to just share with you some of the product that I will be using. I will have all the product linked on Cut at Home's blog so check out the description box for more information on that. I'm using the gorgeous A Ladies Diary collection from Graphic 45 and I will be using these three papers. This one here is my absolute favorite, so I made sure to put that on the front of the card. For my card base, I'll be using a piece of craft cardstock cut to 5 by 10, scored in half at 5 inches. That will give me a 5 by 5 square card. And I will be using this beautiful spot, a Spellbinders Nest Abilities die. This is a gorgeous die. It's the Floral Assortment, and it's a very intricate die, so to get a good cut from it, I will also be using a Sizzix Precision Base Plate. This, to me, is a game changer. If you can't get good cuts, um, I was using just uh, cardstock shims for quite a while, but this I can get great cuts from. Usually what I'll do is set it in there, run it through, turn it, run it through again, and you can get a great cut from doing it that way. I will also be using a Marianne Designs Creatables. This is her rolled rose die. They have a large and a small along with some leaves. I'll be using the small from the same paper. And also one of Marianne Creatables bow dies. I love this die. I will adhere everything down with Angel Craft Tape and Again, check out the description box. I hope you stay tuned for the start to finish on it. Thanks so much for stopping by. Thank you. 